Welcome back. We're doing another technique that's super quick and easy today, our antiquing technique. Let's grab our supplies and get started. We recommend to grab a piece that has a lot of grooves and texture, because that's what will make this technique truly effective. It's used a lot in the winter months when we have our Christmas trees in stock. I decided to use this tile that I've had my eye on for a while. We normally recommend to do this technique with our regular glazes, as it leaves bare pottery spots that need to be dipped. I'm just laying down my colors right now, some rusty grays and pinks. You don't have to worry about them being very detailed, because right now we're just trying to get all of our colors down onto the piece. Let the paint dry, and then take a sponge and dip it into some water, squeezing off the excess. From here, you're going to take the sponge and wipe it across your piece. As you can see, the paint is washing away on the top, but remaining inside of the grooves of the pottery. I went over it a few times due to the colors mixing a bit, and then I let it dry. I know it looks a bit odd right now, but trust me, it'll look great when it comes out of the kiln. This technique is super quick and easy, but gives a really detailed result. Perfect for our Christmas decorations and other fun, antique, and vintage looking pieces. Come in and try it out today.